Hello everyone, and welcome back to more of the Co-op Knights play Near Automata. I'm Joe the Yellow Knight, and uh, yeah, we're picking up pretty much where we left off. Uh, it's been a little while since I played this last, but luckily the combat system is super intuitive and feels super good, as always. And music's great, I played a little bit, just farming some items, but uh, yeah, we're following on with the story. There he is. Let's get him. Alright. Eye out for loot. Go. See, like I said, it's like riding a bike. A rad android. Nope, 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 not going there. That'd be weird. Okay, open box. Fang of the Twins. Hell yes. Alright, what are we. No. Nope. Still in combat, technically? No, okay, there we go. Items. That sounds like a weapon. Enhan uh, must be enhancement. Nope. Port materials, cutfish. Oh, there's another tab for weapons. Figured it out. Weapons. Small swords? Nope. Large swords. Fang of the Twins. Nice. Colossal axe offered into the gods. 310 to 320. 320 to 350. Combo light 2, heavy 2, light 2, heavy 2. So, it's a little bit worse version of my current Beast Lord. But it looks super cool. Yeah, well, we'll just stick with the Beast Lord for now, because it is slightly stronger, and there doesn't seem to be any other benefit to switching. Alright. Um. And I'm going to cut out some of the uh, just basic side questing and a lot of the running around, because this is an incredibly pretty, well-crafted game. But it's also a JRPG, so there is a lot of time where it's just going to be spent idly moving around. Alright, let's get some. Right, ow. Alright. Oh, it's one of you. That can only be a good thing, right? I beat one of you before, though. Oh, that's... That's a new trick. Nothing. You big dummy. And dead. Right? Yeah. Sweet loot. He said something about how everyone was dead and it was all my fault and I'm a murderer, but hey, they're just machines. It's fine. Can you kill something that was never really alive? Am I alive? I have to be alive, right? I'm an android, but I'm like a cool android. Now nah, I'm definitely alive. Right? Sure hope I'm alive. Voltproof sound. Alright. Loot box. A thousand gold. Hell yes. The looting instincts paying off again. Anything up here? Yes, there it is. Copper ore, alright. Yeah, no, 
are continuing on. <laughs> the robot's funny. Poor robot, I'm going to have to beat him up for the crime of being a robot. Don't ask those questions, 9S. Those are like philosophical questions. Oh, that reminds me. Speaking of uh, robots and philosophical, uh, anybody who's watching this should absolutely check out on Netflix Love, Death, and Robots. It's a whole collection of like sci fi and some like supernatural inspired shorts really really freaking good it's it's it is mature rated so there there is a lot of blood and some nudity and violence and things like that but if the Right? That's a little spooky, but uh, yeah, no, it's. Uh, I, I would argue that uh, Love, Death, and Robots is smart enough that it's not using its uh, the more gratuitous aspects just for the sake of those gratuitous aspects. Like, it's not looking to titillate or anything like that. More of like, this is the world they created and. They want to stay within the rules of that world. But it is really super good. My favorite, I would say, I'll tell more about like the different shorts probably next episode, but there are some in there that I absolutely loved. Multiple machines detected ahead. But what's with these android bodies? Stay focused. Now back to this story of robots. Oh dear. Ow. Just imitating human speech there, 9S. That's, that's weird. Ha boom! Ha ha ha! I thought I was out of range of that attack. That's why I didn't bother dodging. It's a little hectic. Oh my god. Uh, dodge, 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 dodge. There we go. Everything's fine. Oops, wrong button. Ignore that. What the hell? Um. What the, 
happening? What the heck? An android? No. This... This is a machine. You're new. What are you? I, I feel a little conflicted about this. Gonna be honest, guys. But unnatural images. Okay. Uh, okay, that's a new one. Ow. All right. Okay, he can shoot now. That's uncool. That's new. Dodge you. Mr. No Pants. Look, I... Key to the moment. I couldn't come up with the best insult there, I'll admit. He was definitely getting stronger there. He was level 10 at the end. Why is he bleeding? He got a dirty butt. Okay, well luckily they're squished by a rock, so that solves our problems, right guys? Be fine. But hey, we killed the scary robot. I was made out of. No. Oh. Looks like we're safe now. It's a healthy baby boy. What the hell just happened? I know. I've never seen a machine like that before. We better report this to command. Yeah, that was. I feel like if that 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 can't be a thing that usually happens. Like somebody would have said something if. That sort of thing usually happened. Right? So that's just a. Oh, where am I going? Oh, 
Understood, Mr. Robot. Alright, so let's get across over here and then walk along that. There we go. Don't fall, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. 300 gold! Swimming in that money. Okay, that's back that way. I want to go back up this way some more, though. Oh my god, okay, I made it. Made it. Alright, so theories about what the machine person thing was. Uh, first theory... Uh, the machines were trying to... They were acting like people, right? They were literally, like emulating well getting it on and things. So maybe something to do with that? Oh dearie me that hurt. A shortcut. Alright. Those guys are good for some money. save because humanoid machines scary and weird not a fan all right well we'll pick this right back up once i get back to the next area and have, don't have to do all this running around so be right back hey welcome back thanks for securing axe i know it isn't mine oh and be sure to swing by if you ever need anything all right Oh, sweet. Thank you very much, sir. Hey, Jackass. I can't ass out in the desert. So, I guess, you know, thanks or whatever. I like you, Jackass. What can I help you with? All right. HP gauge, sound waves, enemy data. So, I think a lot of these I already ha Yeah, I do already have them. But if I die, then die again, I think I lose all of my chips, even these ones that I already innately have? I don't know. But. What else we got? Okay. Nothing else, really. Come back anytime. Yeah, that's just a save point. Anything in the inbox? Here we go. Council of Humanity. Scheduled Correspondence. Ignore that. Attentional androids. Thousands of years have passed since we humans were driven to the moon. And while the war remains deadlocked, we know that our continued safety is only possible thanks to your valiant efforts on the ground. We ask that you continue giving your all to the mission of recapturing Earth from the scourge of the machines. Glory to mankind. Glory to mankind. All right. Operator 6O, Jupiter's Fortunes. 2B, have you heard of the Jupiter fortune telling? It's all the girls over in R&D have been talking about recently. They say you can examine the color and shape of Jupiter's great red spot to learn about what kind of luck you'll have with health, work, and love. Sounds amazing, right? I'll try it and let you know what I find out. Huh. It, it's stuff like that, where it's like... Okay, so we're androids, but that's a very, very, very human thing to do. 
think we've earned a breather. Say to be. I was hoping we could talk about our next move. I'm worried about the damage we took in that last battle with the machines. Maybe we should return to the resistance camp to resupply and conduct maintenance. All right, let's go back. You got it. Now we're gonna go back to the resistance camp just so that I can see if I can't get uh, some better weapons. So we'll pick back up over there. Subquests. You can accept subquests from clients marked as red dots all, all over the world. Subquest destinations are inf indicated as red diamonds on the minimap. Oh, we're definitely doing subquests. This is a JRPG. To not do subquests would be just antithetical to the whole operation. Transport. Okay, I can just go back to the bunker. All right. Nothing new there. But there is something there. Ranged attack up. Small. All right. God, look how wide this man is. Absolute unit. I said that right, right? That's what the kids are saying? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. All right. An enemy. Ah, uh, it's you. I heard from Jackass about your encounter in the desert. Good work. We don't have much to offer in thanks, but I've readied a room for you here. Oh? Hey, cool. It's the least we can do. Feel free to use it however you like. Hey, thanks. Neat. All right, weapons trader. Here for all your weapon-related needs. Ancient Overlord, Beast Bane, Link Five, Hank, and Beast Lord. I don't need to buy all of them because they're not really any better or worse than any others. The titanium alloy, broken keys, and pyrite. Just looking through to see if there's a killfish machine. Huh. Trader, what are we buying? What am I buying? Weapon attack. Pretty much just the same thing. All right. Nothing really new there. Come back soon. Maintenance shop. Let's ask for advice. What would you like advice on? Uh, okay, that's just more tutorial stuff. Shop. Great pond. Okay, I need tree sap, mushroom, pure water, natural rubber, and power up parts small. <laughs> Bye. Okay. Already got the laser. Mirage. Analyzes all enemies in a fixed radius, allowing combatants to deliver deadly slashes to all caught within. Or a hammer. Blade. Spear. Shield. Other shield. Plus eight storage. I might buy one of these plus eight storages. Yeah. Get some more chips available. Okay, uh. Can I just fuse two shockwave ones then? Or shockwave plus one? Adds a shock. slightly weak shockwave to weapon attack. As opposed to, that's a shockwave weapon attack. All right. Okay, yeah. So I had two plus one, so now I've got a plus two. Cool. Come back any time. All right. So now it should be if I go to my skills, plug in ships. So type A, customize. Attack, shockwave plus two. Yeah, I was able to plug that in, neat. So now I get a shockwave attack. So if I 
Okay, so this is all I've got. Does that quite fit? Okay, so it doesn't quite fit. Okay, so yeah, these don't quite fit, so I don't have quite enough room for all these. But I could, if I spend just a little more money. I jumped when I didn't mean to. Right. Yes. Shop. Buy. Another plus H storage for only 5,000. Totally worth it. Alright. Skills. Plug-in chips. Set type A. Customize. Attack. Oh, cannot be equipped for that spot. Okay. Great. So now I've got that equipped. Cool. What else we got? Defense. Max HP up. New defense. Max HP up. That fits. Great. I've got more. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Taunt up. Okay, so that's optimized. I'm not 100% sure what that did, but that's still neat. Ugh, excuse me. Alright. Let's look at our new bedroom. Because androids need to sleep? Do androids need to sleep? This is pretty big. You sure it's okay to get a room like this? We have permission, remember? Plus, we'll probably be stationed here for a while, so a bed won't go amiss. And I guess there's no point turning it down. Damn right, boy. Okay, I can open. Small lock. Small G lock. Gold lock, I guess. Vault proof south. I could just kick some things open, but other boxes, nah, way too chained up. Alright. Do you want to take a break? Yes. Tubi's going to take a little nap. Do you want to save? Also yes. Do you want to continue the game? Yes. Alright, so that's just a full heal. Neat. Alright. Oh. And now... Let's look at the... Didn't mean to save there. Map mode. All right, so there's a side. Qu there's a couple side quests available. Yeah, we're definitely tracking these down. Like, I would be crazy not to try and find side quests. I love, love, love side quests, and especially in a game like this. Like, there's got to be all kinds of juicy lore nuggets and story and upgrades and just so much cool stuff that has to be available if you can find it. And I am going to find it. Mark my words. Yes, I will. I have an incoming message for 2B and 9S from the commander. Initiating playback. 2B, 9S. We've lost contact with several Yorha units that were on their way to the surface. Their black boxes are online, so we presume they're still alive. We've tracked the location of their signal, so I need all your units on the surface to head over and investigate. End transmission. I heard something about that back at the resistance camp. Target location confirmed. I'm worried about the other androids. We should probably check this out as soon as possible. You say as soon as possible, 9S. I say in our own damn sweet time. We have side quests to do, theoretically. Seems like an excellent way to get over this obstacle. Yes. zone. It's very lush. 
like the contrast of the greens and reds. Very pretty. Very saturated. Hello there. Yep. Sorry, we need access to this. Have information unlocked. Yeah, I'll do a quick quick save. Nope. Still nothing in the thing there. Alright, it must be above us. Oh. I guess that was the side quest? Was unlocking this thing? Alright, well, there's another one close by. So, let's try getting to that. See what we've got here. And I'm getting fly... Wait a second. Uh, we've been here before. And when I say we've been here before... We've been here before. That's me! The that's... That's everything I was carrying. That's... That's a little... That's a little weird, like, that, that was us. Our old sword, like... Virtuous Treaty. Is it better than the Beastmaster? Open set one. Oh, wait, 300 to 330. No, but let's, let's try it. Wait a second, there was a story attached? First encounter with my lover. The hell? What's this? Once upon a time, there were three princesses. The eldest princess was thought by all to be the most brilliant woman in the kingdom, and she soon sat upon the throne of her homeland as their queen. Interesting. Twin souls were sacrificed to twin gods and bound to an unbreakable dual-bladed axe. Whenever nicked or damaged, it would instantly repair itself. The two blades would never part. They would be together for the rest of the time. Alright. What about the virtuous contract? Because I upgraded this to level 2. Yeah. How long can I fight amidst this bloody vortex of a battlefield? How long, I wonder? How long can I continue to protect what I love amidst this endless war? How long, I wonder? Huh. Oh, I get attack speed. Wow. Did I read... Did I just miss that when I was looking? Heavy attack. Okay, so that's just saying... Can I quit? Huh. Okay, no. Okay, that just switched them. That's all it did. I was thinking, like, did I just somehow manage to, uh... Oh, you can equip a small sword in the heavy spot. Okay, that's interesting. And then use the big sword as your light weapon. Or your main weapon. So that changes up the combo again. It does a cool shockwave blast. That's neat. So the, I, so the weapons have different abilities based on how you arrange them. And have different stats in different... Huh. So we'll put that there and then Virtuous Treaty in too. Yeah. So that's just attack speed up. But as I was saying, like... I don't know. It's, it's kind of weird in a game for the game to acknowledge, like... Hey, you were here. You did this. This was you. Now look at, you know, what's left. This is, you fought and died right here. And there's proof of your life and death. I like it, but... Like, listen, like, even the music stopped. You just hear ambient background sound. Just make sure that you really get the moment to stop and think. Yeah. That was me. I remember this. Here's proof. 
Huh. Very interesting. Oh, I can go back in here. Wow. Oh, wow, you can literally just go back through the zone. Alright, well, let's keep going back through here. I mean, why not? I am fascinated. Okay. Damn, my fascination. Oh, wait. Hooray, my fascination. Okay, this is cool. Since I'm using both of them, it gives me this blast now. Very nifty. I didn't see that mentioned. I could have just missed it, but... Or it, I may have always had that and just never noticed, which is also entirely possible. Ow. Else, range is better than I expected. Getting a little bit more loot. I'm wondering if there's some sort of, like, secret or something back here that's gonna show for, like, where it all started. Gunning you down. Yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah, this way we get a little bit more experience. Hopefully, uh, unlock some more story content and stuff. But man, even like the boxes are open from before. Like, it's so. I like it, but it's so weird to have a game acknowledge this. Absolutely intriguing, in fact. I won't lie, I do kind of hope that there'll be a shortcut back. That's probably that right there, the elevator, which would let you shortcut some of this. Totally forgot about you guys. I've got a bunch of small recoveries. And making some money. From my previous death. Crafting materials. That's cool. Gold. I really am hoping that there actually is something back here. If not, then this is just a very cool trip down memory lane. Yes, it looks like there may be a way toward these points. Anything to do there? Nope. Oh, 
I don't have any different skills than before, so... Why not that? I him last time too, didn't I? Embarrassing. Oh well. And Ninus seems to have gotten lost somewhere. I'm sure he'll turn up though. He's a good boy. Yeah, there he is. Hell were you? big ruined building where I fought a giant robot the first time. Alright, so I didn't run into anything new. That's a little annoying. That moon... So it looks like these are low, like way below. So I think I gotta unlock that elevator. That's a little annoying. So I guess that was the only side quest we could do immediately. So I think I gotta, gotta do, go do that one. But I think we'll probably leave it here, ladies and gentlemen. I'm just gonna be running back out of here and taking care of all this stuff. Although actually, I'm uh, no, I haven't gotten to save recently, so I can't just quit out. And hopefully, I respawn back there. So I'll have to run my way out. But thank you so much for watching. Um, this is. I don't know, like, I, I can't get complacent with this game. I can't sort of assume I know what's going on, because every time I think I know what's going on, something new and different happens, or even the characters in character ask questions that just don't have easy answers and make you think, like, well, what does all this mean? Like, does it have a meaning? Does it have a purpose? Who knows? Either way. I am super excited to keep playing. I'm really, really enjoying this. Can't wait. I hope everybody's... Whoa, uh oh Oh. Cool. That was totally on accident. Ow. But uh, thank you all so much for watching. As I said, uh, I'll be definitely back with more of this very soon. But until then, I'm Joe the Yellow Knight, and I will see you next time. Bye.